Hello everybody and welcome back to Yakuza 0. Uh, we are back with Majima and uh, last episode I promised that we were going to finish his uh, Cabaret Club minigame. And that is what we're going to do this episode. That's going to be the focus. Uh, with a little bit of side questing, but uh, you guys get the gist. Anyways, uh, before we continue guys, I don't know if you guys uh, hear it uh, any differently, but I kind of tweak some of the settings on my mic. So if you notice that the game audio is kind of fading when I talk, that's that's a filter in OBS. I tinkered with a lot of the filters. And uh, now my uh, voice shouldn't be ear raping you guys every time I raise my voice. Because I've set it so that it decreases it to a certain level when it, when it goes louder than a certain decibel. Anyways, let's, let's move on. Hopefully, uh, you know, it's not as crappy as before, audio-wise. Anyways, let's, uh, you know, go back to Club Sunshine. It's been a long time since I've been in that place. Get the hell out of here, guys. Come on. Don't be douche. I just upgraded all of my moves, bro. You, you want to go right now? I can go if you want, my dudes. I can go all you want. I'm interested to see what ultimate fighting style Majima will get. Cause he's a, he's a, it looks like he's a bat kind of guy. Oh, get the hell out of here. Jeez. I might need to buy some healing supplies. Cause I know we're probably gonna have to do some fighting with Colonel Sanders. Yeah, don't think I've forgotten that guy. All right, the hell out of, get, get back you savages. Good. All right. Out of this house. Out of this house. All right. Yeah, I'm beastly strong, my dude. You're right about that. That's because I'm the protagonist. All right. Left and then right. Oh, it's been a while, Sodenbori. I've missed this place so much. And I don't know why. I don't know. I feel like Sodenbori is a more inviting place than Kamurocho, if I'm being honest. At least in this game. Oh, yes. I hear the sweet, soothing music of Cabaret Club music. I hear the music of the music. Oh, hey, there's Ai-chan dancing like she always does. All right, we're saving before I do anything. We have to be extra cautious. You know, here's hoping that uh, in post-editing, um, my mic doesn't cut out as much as it used to because of my annoying noise gate. I, I hope that it doesn't. I really do, because I, I, I fiddled and researched some of those filters for a long time for this same purpose. All right, yes. Hmm. All right, it's been a while. Club news, a new girl has joined. All right, uh, prepare to open. Uh, do we have special training sessions? We do with I, customer service for. All right, let's do this. All right, ready for another lesson, Ai-chan? I'll give it my all. All right. Remember now, I'm just another customer. Yep, Majima-san, the regular customer. <laughs> Hi, Majima-san. <laughs> I haven't seen you in a while. Let's have fun today. Huh? Sweet as a birthday cake. Let's do it. Ai-chan is, it's, is the best. She's waifu material right there. You have such a cute, bubbly personality, Ai-chan. Bet you were a popular kid back at school. Eh? So not Really? But then again, I guess all gloomy kids have some sort of personality to them. It's just that uh, they choose not to show that part of themselves. To, you know, people they don't like in school. Or just people in general. Like, if they made friends, they'd probably show them all the bubbly personality that they have hidden. Because, you know, that gloomy facade is just one part of a person, I guess, is what I'm trying to say. Seriously? 
Hard to imagine you as a gloomy kid. That really sucks. That really sucks. Don't they know that the gloomy kids always carry the blam blams? Come on, man. Stop bullying the gloomy kid. What? No kidding. So that's why you hated the bullies the last time. Oh, that's a that's a pretty good goal. Yeah, I I've always thought you've been a cheer cheerful person ever since like I don't know, you were birthed. You were born out of your mom's whams. Alright, whatever. Ignore what I just said. I see now. I can't believe it. Must have been rough. You're doing great. Well, for what it's worth, I think choosing this line of work was pretty key to making that change in yourself. Let's keep at it, huh? Both of us. No problemo. That's what Daddy Majima, the eye patch manager, Lord of the Night of Sodenbori, is here for to support all of his workers. Huh. Yeah, that's the spirit. So glad you came to work at our club. We're all counting on you here. You're welcome. I really can't get over that laugh. <laughs> Yeah, dang, forgot about being your customer. <laughs> sure thing. That works. So, Ai-chan, there are any reasons in particular you wanted to become a hostess? Didn't she just say? I see, that's, you're a pretty good person, you want to help people, you want to cheer people up, you want to brighten their day, I guess. Nice. Makes sense. Hard to find a job these days where you really feel like you're making a difference. Try something else. Why would I say that? I feel better now. <laughs> yeah, I feel better even just talking to you, Ai-chan. You really are club's cheerleader, you know? Yes, please. Fantastic. Just don't give out so much positive energy that your batteries run low, you hear? We don't want you to see you get burned out, you know? <laughs> oh, shit. Mmm, girl. Mm, what does that mean? Mmm, yeah. Well, what was it? You recharge your batteries. How am I going to do that, I wonder? Sure, don't know how I do it, but I figure something out. Come on, Majima, you should have done a little flirty flirt there. That was the perfect opportunity. Alright, enough digging around in the past. Let's talk about your future. No offense, but I don't think you're going to make that type of money here at a cabaret club, ai -san. Sounds like a halfway attainable dream, but why would you need it so much? I see. I don't know. I kind of feel like you're already better than them just based on what you were telling me. So, you know, I don't... 
I don't really think... I don't really think you need all the money. Honestly. Hold on, guys. Just trying to... Trying to get this all set. Sorry, I forgot to put this before recording, but I have a notebook in front of me at all times where I record uh, docu or document like uh, different times of recording where I know I need to edit something out. Like if I make a strenuous sound or if I like, uh, I don't know, ear rape you guys with a sneeze or some shit, I'll edit it out and I'll write the timestamp down on my notebook for post editing pro uh, process. Anyways, let's move on. I see. Invite me over then. Hell yeah, money ain't everything. Ooh, that's the spirit. I don't know. Hmm. I want to say that's the spirit, but I also kind of want to say money ain't everything. You know what? Let's do that. Money ain't everything, you know? When you're in a bad spot, it's gonna be people who pull you up. It ain't gonna be cash. That's not necessarily true. Well, there's a glass half empty. If you ever need the help, just let me know, okay? I'll help you no matter how much money you got. Good. That's what I was hoping you'd say, Majima. You know, sometimes you and I are uh, uh, linked to, through telepathy or some shit, you know? It's almost as if, like, uh, I'm controlling you or something. <laughs> <laughs> Anytime. That's what I'm talking about. Get those managerial skills up to snuff. All right. You think you'll ever settle down, Ai-chan? No, you won't ever be able to get the Google, the, the, you don't, you won't ever get to do the giggity with your boyfriend if you get one, come on, man. Or I guess you can, it's just going to be awkward. I mean, he can still do that, right? But you don't necessarily have to live with your mom and dad. Hmm, sort of like adopting your husband. That would be weird. I mean, I mean, I guess we're, technically speaking, if you marry into someone's family, you're sort of kind of getting adopted, seeing as how they become like your daughter or son-in-law. So, you know, maybe I'm thinking a bit too much into this. I, I, I guess I wouldn't mind necessarily. <laughs> I could be with a girl I loved. I wouldn't be an issue, I guess. Oh, <laughs> Well, hey, if a guy is lucky enough to marry a girl as cute as you, you should have no problem getting adopted into your family. Hell yeah! I beg to differ. I'm slipping into your heart as we know it, girl. All right, I think we can call it quits here. Majima-san, thank you for the lesson. Yeah, really good job. So, let's see. That was a perfect lesson. Yes, baby. First time back and we just got a perfect lesson. That's what I'm talking about. You got this hostess, hostess thing down, Ai-chan. I was really having a good time there. Oh, really? I'm so glad. I feel more confident now. Good. Keep doing your best. Thank you very much. Yes. Noise. All right, that special training is done. Uh, we got one. Uh, we got one person on the cast here who's feeling sad. 
So let's uh, switch her out with uh, Etsuko over here, who's new, and I don't think I have used her just yet. Um, Seiko is kind of feeling a bit down. Oh, Dolly. I haven't used her yet either. I'm surprised. Okay. All right, Dolly, let's give you a shot. If I recall correctly, that's the mother who was getting hassled by uh, that guy for money, right? And, uh, no, no, wait. Yeah, that's, uh, that's the mother of the little girl who Majima was getting the plushies for and stuff, right? Yeah, I remember. I remember you, Dolly. All right. Um, makeover, hostess list club status. Let's see. Hmm. I need to get Grand Hera as a potential partner. So I need to hang out more there. Smart. We got everything in Club Jupiter area. We got 3,000 fans. Oh, wait. No, this is the other clubs. We got 15,000 fans. Get the fuck out of here with that chump change. Get the hell out of here with your scrub fan count, Jupiter. Club Jupiter. Get the hell out of here. You too, Club Mars. What are you, scrubs? All right, uh, Club... You two, get the hell out of here, Club Mercury. Fucking scrubs. Get the hell out of here, Club Moon. Fucking scrubs. Get the hell out of here, Club Venus. Fucking scrubs. Everyone here is a scrub. All I need to do is beat the hell out of them. And then I got all the club scene in my pocket. All right, um... So I forgot. Who am I... Okay, so I need to make more fans in the Jupiter area. In the Venus area. And I haven't gotten any from the Moon area. So I should start that soon. Club Mercury. Where's Colonel Sanders from again? I think he might have been from uh, Club Jupiter. Okay, let's let's open in Club Jupiter area. Alright, uh, open for business. And I gotta remember how to play this minigame because I've forgotten. It's been such a long time. All right, uh, target club Jupiter area. Hell yeah. It's finally time to listen to the awesome music again. Look at the granny. Wealthy. All right. You want some eye? You're some eye. Hopefully I don't get those ultra mega rich douchebags who don't want anybody. All right. Here's a Rhonda. Uh, it's, it's triangle. Uh, refill ice. All right. I think I still got it. I think I still got it. I remember most of it. Oh yeah, special cutscene time, baby. Here's your daily dose. Here is your daily dose of thumbs up, girl. Mm. All right. Did we always get this amount of time? I don't know. I feel like we've gotten longer times before. Maybe I've just progressed through this so much that I, I I feel like it's too short now. Already? What's going on here? Refill ice? Special cutscene again? Oh yeah, oh, oh yeah, you know it, baby. Here's your second dose of encouragement. Thumbs up, baby. Hmm. Everybody's encouraged? Good. Alright. Check. Would you like to extend your session, sir? Hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about. What's up? Uh, guest glass. Mm, 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 mm. Bum, 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 bum. I really enjoy the club music in this game. Oh, we gotta... Oh. Oh. Wait, what's this guy's preference? We gotta... 
Oof. Oof. All right. Sorry, sir. Looks like you're gonna have to get someone you don't like. Powell. Oh. Dolly, I, I'm sorry. You got paired with a duke. Uh, ladies glass. Sorry you got uh, paired with a dickish. Dick dish kanazi. Bum, 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 bum. You know what? Everybody get fever time, baby. Nice. Oh, he's asking for the check. Which I failed to get. All right, gracious send off. Making all that cash, baby. Gracious send off. We can afford a expensive gift or two. Well, we're making all that cash, baby. All right, uh, gracious send off. Oh, we're back to normal. Let's see if we can get two fever times. Level two or higher. Uh, guest glass. Ladies glass. Nice. Get some Namiko in your life, sir. Bum, 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 bum. Extend session? Nope. All right, thank you for coming, sir. What's up? Uh, ladies glass. Oh, here, get some eye in your life. We're making all that cash, baby. All right, let's see. Oh, Yuki, nobody likes the new girls. Damn. Uh, swap ashtray. Alright, you can wait then. Thank you. Let's see if this guy... Well, there you go, Namiko. Refill ice. What's up? Refill ice. Damn it. All right, all right, all right. I got a simple solution to all this, sir. Got a bam. Oh, that wasn't enough to get him to fever time. Well, that sucks. Sorry for your regrettable experience, sir. All right, how much cash did we make? That's a lot of. That's a lot of cash. Nice. 600 more Jupiter customers. All right, let's see. Is this guy going to come over? Or no? Nothing, eh? Nothing quite yet. 
Damn. How many customers do you guys think we need to have this guy come and face us? All right, cast on duty. All right, time to get some new people on the docket this time. Psycho. Akemi. Hiroko. Dolly's good. All right, special training. We got a pool date. You know what? We can't mess this up. Let's do this. All right. Let's go out for a practice day. We're going to play pool today. Let's battle it out over nine ball. Yay, that sounds like fun. I'm looking forward to it, Majima-san. Yeah, baby. Oh, nope. Banking. Ooh. 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 Yeah. Aight. Damn it. Oh, damn. Got the animation and everything. Oh, hell yeah, girl. I won the first time I played this. I think I got it. Not bad, but not good. She hasn't really given me a good opportunity to get that in the hole, did she? That wasn't a sexual innu innuendo, by the way. How do I do overtop view again? Oh, I have it. Okay. You know what? I'll just... Crap. Not yet. Don't you dare get it in. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Ooh. Ah. Uh. Ma. <laughs> no, that would get five in, and then I'd be in trouble. All right, let's try that. Oh crap! Oh crap! No, no, no. Okay. I'm good. Yeah. I'm safe. Oh, she's going for the ricochet. Okay, this is going to be me playing pool for like 20 million hours. Okay, uh... I'd say there's no way I'm getting that in. So, I'll just do that. Eventually, we're going to get a good opportunity. Not yet. Come on, I give me a good opportunity to get that in the hole, girl. Yeah. Oh, nice. Thank you for that. Now I get to place the ball. <laughs> Hell yeah. Mm. Well, you already know where it's going. It's going right here. Bam! Got him! Okay. Uh, two. Let's just get it out of there. Whoa! Okay. <laughs> that was lucky. That was not... Okay. No, it wasn't lucky. I'm just the most skilled pool player in the Yakuza history. Okay.
All right. Ooh, I get I gave I a crappy position. Wait, you can't do that. Ow. Got him. You already know where my ball is going. It's going right there. Where I could perfectly make it in. Best pool, best pool player in the world, baby. All right. And now four is right in front of me as well. So let me not. Let me not mess this up. Okay. A little bit to the left. And... Shit. Too much to the left. Okay, I screwed that one up myself. Not yet. Trying to give me another foul? Come on, stop trying to get other balls into the hole. Uh-huh. <laughs> All right. Come on. No, I bounced off the wall. This is the longest pool game in the history of pool. Oh, is she gonna get something in? Nope. Man, I, you suck as much as I, I mean, you, you, you don't know how to play this game, do you? I don't suck at this game. I'm great at this game. Okay, uh, you know what? Screw it. Hit it. Bam. Got him. Have to take the real risks here, boys and girls. All right, uh... All right. All right. Gotta give it a little back tap. Bam. Not yet. Oh. Carom shot. Foul. Or not foul. Alright, I guess not foul. Because she get it she hit a carom shot. Damn. Crappiest position. Nice. Very nice. Very nice shot. Very nice. Don't get don't get that in. Oh my god. She's you're killing me. You're killing me over here, girl. No. Okay. All right. All right. Damn it. So close to a foul. Okay. That's fine. Ooh. Let's hit that with all we got. Oh, shit. Oh, I gave her a foul. That's, that's not good. I think she's about to win this game, ladies and gents. Not yet. I think he's about to win this game. Well, yep. I'm screwed. GG. GG's. All right. All right. All right. Well, I'll let it slide because you're adorable. But next time, I'm kicking your ass at pool.
Today's practice, did, what do you mean? Wait, just because we lost a game of pool? You're right, I didn't learn that much. I didn't think you'd be worse than me. <laughs> that sucks. Well... That did suck indeed. But it wasn't that bad. It was close. If I hadn't gotten that foul at the last minute, then, you know, we would have, we would have, we would have hit bank, baby. All right, uh, let's open for business again in the, lo, 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 in the Club Jupiter area. And this time I'll probably just skip this. All right, at this point, after doing the last three star fever, I've basically given every single one of the people who wanted their checks an expensive gift so that they could spread more word of mouth. So let's see how many fans we get this time around compared to the last time around. Let's see if it makes any significant improvements. Uh, fan count wise, love. This guy's looking for love. Okay. You look for love if you want, my friend. I'm not gonna stop you. Oh. Give apology gift. Okay. I don't mind losing that many. Okay, it doesn't really make that huge of a difference, does it? Honestly. Nothing? What the hell is going on? Wait, is it really nothing? Okay, hold on just a second. Okay, um... Hmm. Maybe I have to break the 3,000 fan... 3,000 fan thingies. Maybe I have to break 3,000 fans for Club Jupiter area. So that uh, Mr. Colonel Sanders comes back over. Oh yeah, I forgot this is a thing. No! Here you made it on air. Sorry, Majima. Alright, let's write a thing. Let's write about the street performer. Sure, whatever. Yuki, send the letter without complaining. Come on. Bus kill. Alright, let's get up. Let's get back out there. Let's train eyes some more, and this time, let's not completely suck at it. Alright, cool. Um, prepare to open cast on duty. Dolly not doing so hot. Alright, let's, uh, let's bring back our uh, platinum goddesses. Uh, Junko, Yoko, Harumi. We need people in excellent condition. Namiko, Hirara, and Ume. All right. Some sometime one of these days I'm going to have to actually pick hostesses based on not only their status but also their affinities. One of these days I'll actually pay attention to that, but for now we're on easy mode, so I'm not worried about it. All right, special training. Customer service final. Oh, this is the last time we're going to talk face to face, eh? 
All right, Aichan. I think your customer service skills are in pretty good shape, so let's make this our last talk. The last one? How exciting. Hi, Majima-san. I haven't seen you in a while. Let's have fun today. You're cheerful as ever. Let's do this. All right. You've been at our club for a while now. Are you setting, settle in? Yes, I agree. Very sad and lonely exper uh, experience to live through. Dude was a prick. I hear ya. Welcome to Sunshine. <laughs> well, you made the right choice. Switching clubs. Welcome to Sunshine. Hi. Hey, it's uh, it's uh, it's it's beneficial to both of us. It's uh, mutual, you know. You get a good working environment. I get to make more money, you know. And I get a cute little, cute little minx like you in the mix too. Uh. Hawaii. Glad to hear it. And you know we got your back. You need anything? Just say the word. So <laughs> Looking forward to it. Perfect. Hey, Aichan. Is there anything about working here that bothers you? Is she gonna try to dig on me again? Is she gonna try to bro Majima again? I swear. What is it? You can tell me. Oh, come on. That's... That's that's part of this business. If they're over horny, just, you know... Just pat them on the head and say goodnight, you know? Pat them on the head. Uh, uh... Take them out back and, uh, you know, have our security detail uh, kick the shit out of them. They try anything, you know? These days, they're calling that sexual harassment. Not on my watch. No. Kind of crap doesn't fly here. You run into anyone who tries anything, and I'll take care of them personally. Just flag me down. Bottom line is, I can come to a cabaret club to enjoy a good conversation with a beautiful lady. That's the product, not your bodies. Always have been. Takes out the space gun, puts on a space suit, points it at I. <laughs> Anything else on your mind about work? Or are you? <laughs> we got a comedian. Nice one. Slipping that in there. <laughs> that laugh. So adorbs. All right. I understand how you feel about work, but uh, give me a rating now. Anything I can do to improve my game? Anything you don't like? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> hey, that's great. Makes me happy to hear it. So, give me more. What's perfect about me, huh? Okay, you're busting my balls here, lady. Suddenly you're struggling. Too many choices. <laughs> There's so many perfect things about me that you can't pick one, huh? <laughs> Joking, of course. Hell yeah. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. 
私の悩んでることも分かっちゃうなんてやっぱり真島さんは完璧ですねうん、huh? uh, wow I was joking but if you're actually gonna believe it what choice do I got Jesus Jesus Christ by the way where are you originally from I chan 私は九州の方ですね2年前にこっちに出てきたばっかりなんですよ I see Gotcha That means you probably know Sorenbori pretty well by now You got any restaurants or clubs you like to go to? Hmm, I don't have a place but I'm going to go to the night in the night Is Bishamon Bridge the name of a restaurant or an actual bridge? Questions that I will never find out the answers to Why is that? Okay, it's an actual bridge then. Wanna go together? <laughs> that place is nice, ain't it? I like it too. You wanna go together next time? Hell yeah! Sweet! It's a date. Oh hell yeah, this is happening. This is happening. Yeah? What was that last part again? Ah, yeah. You know what it was, Majima san. Hmm, you're acting weird, Ai chan. <laughs> the buggy eyes. Okay, Ai chan. This is a wrap. Majima-san, thank you for the lesson. Yeah, good job. So let's see, the lesson was perfect, baby. Two in a row, I mean, two two actual sit-down conversation lessons and perfect in a row. We're gonna exclude that crappy one that happened never, of course. All right. You got this hostess thing down, Ai-chan. I was really having a good time there. <laughs> oh, really? I'm so glad. <laughs> I feel more confident now. Good. Keep doing your best. Hi. Thank you very much. Ano? Um, Majima-san? Hmm? Huh? What's up? <gasps> so this is the end of our training together, right? Sure is. Ai-chan, you're more than capable of working as a hostess without any more of this practice. That does make me happy, but I wish I could keep talking to you, Majima-san. Uh. Hey, no problem. Do you want to go to Bishamon Bridge like I promised? Eh? Ooh, thank you. Let's go. Let's go. Nice. Hell yeah. Social link time, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Social link to the moon. Social link. Oh, wait. Or, whoa. This is an actual side quest? What? Ah, this place is so nice. I feel like I can relax here. Yeah, I gotta agree. I ain't got great memories of this town, but I do like the view from Bishamon Bridge. Oh, really? I really like it here, too. And this time, I'm here with you, Majima-san. Just the two of us. <laughs> that makes you happy? Hi. Oh, yes. I really am happy. I can't remember the last time I got to walk around with someone. Actually, no. Now that I remember, we had a similar side quest with Yuki-chan, right? Uh, where we thought she was dating another guy, so we went to look out with her. Uh, to her. We came... We went... We followed her to look out for her to make sure she wasn't dating someone who was taking advantage of her. Alright. That's so. Now that you mention it, though, I do remember you saying you don't get out with your friends too often. Like? Yeah. I didn't really make friends with the bullies back at school. And I haven't been in Osaka long, so I haven't had many chances to make friends here either. Yeah, that's a real bummer. But the way you're going on now, I chan you'll be breaking more friends than you can count in no time flat. Do you really mean that? Thank you. <laughs> Besides, Aishan, I think everyone at Sunshine's already considers you a friend. Eh? Really? You think so? I would love it if that were true. Yeah, it is true. You know, I think Sunshine is a really strong club. I think so. I feel like we've got a ways to go before we are in the same tier as those top clubs. Don't know what you're talking about. They have scrub fans. We have like 17,000 fans right now. Those other clubs suck ass. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I know that. But that's not what I meant. 
I was talking about the club's attitude. Huh? Its attitude? Polite? Yes. When I was bullied in school, all I ever did was run away. The people of Sunshine don't buckle under pressure. Even when other clubs try to cause trouble, Sunshine is always up for the challenge. That's the real strength. That's why I don't think I need to run from trouble anymore. Sunshine has changed me for the better. <laughs> yeah, the sun will do that to you. I hear. I can predict I can't predict the future, but as long as we stick together, goddamn. My mouth is dry as hell. I need to drink some goddamn water. <coughs> Damn. I said drink water, not fucking choke on it. <coughs> yeah. Sure. Jesus Christ. This is supposed to be a serious, somber moment, too. God damn you, water. <clears throat> Alright. Yeah, the sun will do that to ya. For ya, I hear. I can't predict the future, but as long as we stay together, we'll make it through whatever the world throws our way, right? Yes, of course. Let's do our best together. <laughs> That's the spirit, I chan You shine when you're cheerful, alright. We should get going. Hmm? Something wrong? Uh, Majima-san, before we go, can I ask you one last question? Uh -huh. Sure. What? Uh -huh. Um, Majima-san, you have this image of being all business, but I was wondering, would you ever consider going out with a girl? Going out with a girl, huh? Hmm. Sure, if the girl came along. Sure, work's important, but if the right girl comes along, I might consider going out with her. Uh -huh. Oh, really? You would do that? I'm kind of surprised. Good to know there's a chance. Hell yeah! Huh? huh? N no, it's nothing. It, It's getting real chilly. Should we get going? Uh. Yeah, we should go. Ai-chan, I'm counting on you. Hi! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> what the hell? Is that smile? What is that? That is some creepy pasta shit. <laughs> oh my god, that face is so fucking creepy. Oh my god. Oh, of course. <laughs> I just can't with that face. Oh, okay. Of course. And I'm counting on you too, Majima-san, as a friend. Absolutely. It's an honor to be your first one of those. Now you can't go around saying you got none either. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Majima-san. Your advice and friendship mean everything to me. Oh, what was that face? That was not kawaii. I'm sorry, that was creepy as hell. Jesus. Oh, I will never be able to unsee what I just saw. Oh. Oh. All right. Calm down. Let's get back into it. Let's open for business again. In the Club Jupiter area. This time we're going to surpass 3,000 customers, I think. So... Something better happen. Alright, I'm skipping over this one too. All right, we finally earned 3,000 fans in the Club Jupiter area. And this is, should, you know, this should boost us into the next thingy, right? Yeah! <laughs> Congratulations, Manjima-san. We reached 3,000 fans from the Club Jupiter area. Way to go, joda chan Club Jupiter's area... Whoa, what the hell was that? Sorry, guys, I just saw my lights flash for a second. Might have been a... Quick outage. Alright. Way to go, Yoda-chan. Club Jupiter's area will soon be ours. Aye. Yeah. This probably means Kazuka's gonna make a move again. Hello, Majima-san. 
Hello, Saki. Hey, you're from Club Jupiter. You're busy bee. You're busy bee, Saki. The guy who works every day. Oh. Please don't call me that. You're, you'll embarrass me. What can I do for you today? You here alone, Saki-chan? Oh. Yep. Kazuka told me to give you this challenge. A challenge? So we're finally gonna go head to head, huh? I'm really sorry about the other day. I want our next battle to be fair and square. Yeah, we'll do this cabaret club battle style, right? Hi. Yes, as long as I'm around, I won't let Club Jupiter lose. <laughs> well, I chan could take you guys on all <laughs> Yuki. Well, I chan could take you guys all on by herself. As long as we've got her, there's no way we can lose either. Come on, Yuki chan, you've gotta pull your weight too. <laughs> That's funny. Your club is fun. I'm looking forward to taking you on. I'll see you later. All right. Okay. She's a great girl. And that means she'll be a tough opponent. Eh. Yes. Club Jupiter is strong. Let's make sure to adjust our staffing roster and make all the necessary preparations before we take him on. Okay. All right. <clears throat> We're saving. First off. Since we finally got to this point, give a savey sue. So it's not Colonel Sanders, eh? I was under the impression that it was. Unless Kazuka is Colonel Sanders, and I just forgot his name. Alright, let's get out of here. And open the club again. Actually, no, battle. Let's check the roster. <clears throat> <clears throat> Let us prepare to open. Oh, everybody seems okay. Hmm. 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 You know what? Psycho's back on. Hmm. Not a lot of people like Dolly. Hmm. <clears throat> a lot of people like Irondo for some reason, though. Alright, I think I'm satisfied with that roster. Let us do that rival battle. Versus Club Jupiter. Perfect. Oi. Yo, Club Sunshine. Started to ignore my warnings, huh? Figure you'd go you could go doing whatever you want it you want to, goddammit. You just asking for it, aren't you? Kazuka, Club Jupiter. All we're doing here is running the business on the straight and narrow. Unlike you. You're gonna regret the day you lay hands on Yoda chan. I can promise you that much. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you'd come to my club for revenge after that, but you chickened out, huh? Loser. It's not that I chickened out, is that what is that I would totally annihilate your ass along with all of your club. And that wouldn't be fair and square, but we're here now about to fight fair and square between clubs, you know? And that's the right way to do things, which is why we're doing it. Cause I'm a man of principles, dude. Sometimes at least. Come on, Kizuka. Didn't come, you didn't come here to try and hurt my feelings, did ya? I don't bruise easily. We'll find out who the loser is after that cabaret club battle. Uh. Fine. If you're in such a hurry to get your ass kicked, I'll crush you. And I'm gonna enjoy this loser. <laughs> <laughs> so will I. Can't wait to see your face when the underdog bites you in the ass. Fine, let's do this. Here we go. Club Sunshine's open for business. Face off. Let's do this. How is he making that much already? I call hacks. That's what I call. I call hacks. Yo, 
バボンバンバンバンバボンバンバンバン。Alright, we're just not getting that many wealthy people right now. Ladies' glass. It's slowing down for him. We'll catch up eventually. Because we were on fire these last couple of times. Jeez. All at the same time, huh? Ladies' glass. Oh, yeah, your daily dose of a thwumpus. Of a thwumpus umpus. Here's your thwumpus umpus. Thwumpus umpus. There you go. Much encouragement given. Alright, ladies' glass. Man, that's too bad, my very wealthy friend. Uh, thank you. Let's see if he likes Yuki. He does. Alright, here you go. Oh, nice. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. Um, screw you. How about that? You can't mess with my club, sucker. Stand session? Nope. Alright, that's cool. Thank you for visiting, sir. Gracious sender. Oh, we're back to normal. Alright, here you go. And refill the ice. You're welcome. Nice. Extend session? Hell yeah! Give a time, baby! Uh, guest glass. Perfection. Uh, swap ashtray. Perfection. Perfection. Uh, ladies' glass. Perfection. Come on, let's get to level three. On the fever meter. <laughs> Extend session? Nope. Thank you for visiting, sir. Alright, fever time. Yeah, baby! We got three wealthy guys here. Gracious send off. Alright. Perfection. A lot of gracious send offs. Sorry, guys, gotta make all the money today. We are being challenged by an invading club. Actually, it, it's fair to say that we're the invaders, but screw them. Man, your club sucks. It really slows down in the end for you, doesn't it? Oh, mega rich. Hell yeah. Give me more money. 
Average? Hello, average sir. Thank you for choosing my club. Ladies' glass. This guy is looking for love. Swap ashtray. Bum, 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 bum. Why do I feel like uh, the other club is biding their time until they can do a three wave fever? Probably what they plan on doing, right? Extend session? Hell yeah, fever time, baby! What's up? Ladies glass. Nope. Extend session? Hell yeah! Fever time for the mega rich, baby! Look at all that cash. Gracious send off. Here's some more fever time, baby. Might as well fever till the end. All right, how much cash we make? Oh, we make almost twice as much as you. Get wrecked. Get wrecked, son. Get wrecked. That's what you get for talking all that smack. That's what you get, buddy. Good old buddy, old pal. Hell yeah. We've infiltrated successfully. You're gone. You're out of here. I... I lost? <laughs> Yuki-chan. Hi, Chan. Thanks. You were both awesome. I was nervous, but I did everything I could. You look so tense, Yuki-chan. I thought you were going to faint. I even saw you foaming at the mouth. Eh? What? That's a lie. No way. I can't believe it. I, s I, I said it wasn't true. Eh? Got it. I'm talking about you. Just can't believe I didn't win. Ah! Oh, sorry. But that part's true. Damn. Guess I really lost. Damn. <laughs> huh? What's so funny? Oh, my bad. I don't know. Once the shock were off, I just felt like laughing. Okay. Alright, we're gonna settle this like men now with our fists. What? Fists? The hell? Look, we settled the score already. What the hell was the Cabaret Club battle for then? <laughs> details, details. I never liked that damn Cabaret Club battle in the first place. That's because you suck at it. It's all a bunch of bullshit. A real man's gotta settle things with his fists. What the hell? <laughs> Saki-chan? The old Kizuka-san's finally back. <laughs> Majima, get your ass out front. Let's do this like real men. You ain't hearing a damn word I say, are you? Whatever. At the end of the day, suppose I'm better at fighting than running a cabaret club myself. Oh yeah? That settles it, baby. Here we go. All right, time to get your ass handed to you then. Let's go, buddy. Oi, 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 oi. Oi, oi, oi. Man, you don't even have that much health. All right. Here, have some bat. Bam! You enjoyed swallowing that bat, my dude? Yeah, enjoy the bat, my friend. Ah. 
All right. Bam! Stompy stomp. Bro, you suck. I really should get more healing items, though. All right. Here, have another heat move. Oh, there you go. Bam, baby. That's what I'm talking about. You ever gonna lay a strike on me, my dude? Is your aura ever gonna pop up? Well, you're done for. You kinda suck, I'm not gonna lie, buddy. Couldn't get one hit in on me. You're pretty strong. You ain't so bad, yourself. Even though you haven't touched me one time, I got scraped somehow. <laughs> well, there you have it. I lost. Complete and total defeat. Lost with my club and I lost with my fists. What? Why did he start laughing all of a sudden? Should I call the police? No, I think he's just a dignified man who is truly a man of his word when it comes to the art of the fists, I guess. Hmm. Mm -hmm. No, it'll be okay. This is what Kizuka-san of Club Jupiter is really like. Club Sunshine's Majima, hey. You're not bad, bro. You got a mean right hook. You ain't so bad yourself. You did all right in the club battle, but in the ring, you're a real bruiser, my friend. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Running a cabaret club was never my thing. Fighting's what I'm good at. Always been that way. Yeah, that's what I thought. You sure look the part. Said the pot to the kettle. We're cut from the same cloth, you and me. <laughs> hey, speak for yourself. Sukiyama-san dra uh, Sukiyama dragged me into the five stars because of my expertise in violence. Sukiyama. That guy is a mad genius. You stick with him, the money just keeps flowing in. But at some point, my life turned into a running, just into just running around trying to stay on Tsukiyama's good side. I did one dirty job after another. Every day was all about keeping up with Tsukiyama's quotas. No matter how much money I made, life sucked. Kizuka san. But it's curtains on all that. I lost a club sunshine, so I'm sure I mean nothing to that guy now. Thanks for settling. Thanks for, the, la, 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 la. Thanks for setting me free. Uh. I don't think I get it, but uh, you're welcome. Well, all that's left is to make my exit. I'd rather not hang around and wait for Sukiyama to take me out. I think I'll go someplace far away. So does he really like actually send hitmen after you, or uh, is that just a figure of speech, which I doubt it is? But you know, genuine question. What's gonna happen to Club Jupiter? I'll shut it down. I'm tired of running a club just to be someone's bitch. Saki, thanks for everything. Sorry to make you worry. Mm -hmm. It's okay? Yo, Majima, would you consider hiring Saki at your club? What? Hell yeah. kizuka san This gal has a bit of a history and she doesn't have the time to waste looking for a new job. Thinking the five stars wouldn't be able to get to her at your club. Besides, she's a real earner. <laughs> Ain't gotta tell me that. Hell, I should be the one begging her to come along. Yeah, that's great to hear. Saki has dreams. Help her chase her dreams at your place. Please. kazuka san thank you. See ya, Saki. Thank take care. Mm. You too, kazuka san You're Yoda, right? Who? Uh, me? I'm sorry for sending my boys to your club. Yeah. Um, I was pretty sure I was gonna die. <laughs> Good for you, buddy. <laughs> what? Um, dude, I was pretty sure your dudes were gonna kill me. <laughs> yeah, good for you, buddy. You little, you little freak. You little freak thought he was gonna... Good for you. You thought you were gonna die? Good for you, buddy. Okay, what? Okay, okay. bye, Kazuka. Man... He gives me brother vibes, you know? There was nothing good about it. Uh, Majima-san. Uh -huh. Hmm? What? Did you mean it about the job? I'd really like to come work with you. Yeah, yeah totally. We'd be unstoppable with Busy Beam Saki on the roster. I'll be expecting good things from you. Mm. You got it? I'll give it my all. <sighs> yeah, baby, another Platinum Hostess joins the team. I'm looking forward to working with you, Saki-chan. 
Hi Chan from Club Mars. You're the number one girl in Sodenbori Cabaret Club, Perky Girl Division. <laughs> it's an honor to work with you, Ai chan the Pleasure is mine. So, Yuki chan, you got a rank in this cabaret club division? What's it? Shit. <laughs> Don't be silly, Majima san. You can't measure the, the value of a person based on some leaderboard. <sighs> uh, yeah, of course not. Probably because you're not on it. Oh, okay. Off to the side. Totally not suspicious. Tsukiyama. So, Izuka has been defeated. Yes? Then I'm not really exactly surprised. He ran the club like an amateur. It was hardly uh, the five, up to the five star standards. Now, oh, now. That's not very nice, Katomi. But how are we going to deal with Kizuka? I've already contacted a specialist. It might be a bit of a challenge with Kizuka being who he is. But there is no need for you to dirty your hands with it. Tsukiyama-sama. I see. I'm fortunate to have such a talented assistant. You're too kind. Now, please let the entertainment continue, Goro Majima of Club Sunshine. Alright, blocks have been unlocked for the slugger style. Congratulations on defeating Club Jupiter. You got a bonus of 1 billion yen. Hell yeah. Baby. Oh, hey. Oh, nothing. You're just gonna sit at the bar. Are you drunk? Are you drunk? Okay, she's probably drunk. I'm gonna go save. You know, it's been one hour and a half for me. One hour and a half. And this is only one Cabaret Club battle. So I doubt I'm gonna even be able to finish it in this episode. The whole Cabaret Club minigame, that is. Alright, so we've beat Club Jupiter. Now, let's see. Oh, Yuki's out. She's not feeling so good. Uh, let's prepare to open. Alright, uh, cast on duty. Saki. Etsuko. Dolly. We need to get Dolly's levels up. Arumi. Let's go with... Hiyoko. Kemi, Hiroko, so many similar names, Endo, and Hirara. Alright, decent cast, and we've probably got special training for Saki now. Yep, customer service one. All right, let's get into it. Let's see her personality. All right, you ready to talk, Saki? Of course, let's do this. Remember, you gotta treat me like a regular customer, okay? It might be difficult, but I'll manage. Um, hello, I'm Saki. Let's have a great time today. You got, a, you got an open and direct way of talking. I like it. All right, here we go. Can you tell me something about yourself? And what'd you do on your days off? Same. Yeah. Sleeping? Damn. Mm -hmm. That's pretty health conscious of you. Did, did you play sports as a kid or something? Hi. Nice. I couldn't do that for the life of me. Nailed it. I guess there's a reason they called you Busy Bee uh, Saki. God damn it, I want to say Baki so much. But it's Saki. Alright. I guess there's a reason why they called you Busy Bee Saki at Club Jupiter, isn't there? Yeah. 
毎日ジョギングは続けてますしたまに友達と山登りもするかな。You wanna go kick Sukiyama's ass for me? That's amazing. You must、uh, really like exercise, Saki chan. So, this is a little bit of a boy. No, not really. Nah, those are cool. Ain't nothing wrong with the sporty hobbies. I think they're cool. Doesn't matter. Yeah? Well, screw them. Not many girls in our industry are into that, so it makes you unique, Saki chan. You gotta be proud of that. What can I say? I'm just, you know, the best sometimes, you know? So, do you have any other hobbies? So, that's it. That's, that's always a good thing. It's always a good thing.、Huh? Hey, cooking! That sounds pretty domestic. Maybe that'd be a subject、uh, you wouldn't feel bad about bigging up. Are you bad at cooking? What's the matter? Nothing scores more points than being a good cook. What's your specialty? What the hell? What is that? Let's play a. I love karage! Chicken's good, and fried chicken's better. Okay, alright. It's fried chicken? That's not bad. Pretty good. Just add some fried rice to it, and there you go. You got a good, good ass meal right there. Man, I can't cook for the life of me. Even if I try to make fried chicken, which is probably one of the simplest things to do, it'd probably come out bland and too crispy or burnt. I gotta practice my cooking, but yeah, no, I, it, it may be simple to some people, but not all. No way. There's a technique to frying up chicken, right? The flavor, the temperature, the oil, the.、Uh... Understandable. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. Heck, bring me some of that fried chicken goodness next time you make it. Hell yeah! So, how do I get to know you a little better, Saki chan? Let's see. Do you got any talents? Hey, that's, that's an okay thing.、Eh? Handling kids. Can I be your bro? Nah. Open a daycare. Uh, you'd make a good mom. That's a good quality to have. You'd make a great mom someday. Fair enough. That's very fair enough. I know how you feel. Can't even imagine having a family. Suppose we gotta find a good partner first. Yeah, fair enough. Hey, and I'm only 24, Saki chan. Oh shit. The, Majima doesn't look that old. Come on. You don't gotta act that surprised. Jeez. Hurting my feelings. Well, let's flip the script. How about your weaknesses? Oh.、Eh? Damn. With, with authority. Kind of bugs give you the shivers. 
どんな虫って虫はほぼ無理ですよ見るのも嫌<笑> That face <笑> I don't like insects <笑> You hate them that much, huh? はい中でもよく台所に出る黒いあれ私あれが死ぬほど苦手なんですよ。Let that be a lesson to ye kids. Clean your kitchens, or lest the black bugs come and infect your house. Hey, I'll let you in on a little secret. I kinda lose my shit when I see a big bug too. 一人暮らし始めてからまだ会ったことはないけど、もしあれと遭遇したらどうすればいいんだろう。Call me over. We talking roaches? I'll come squash it. Hey, I can swing by with a shoe of death. You want? Yeah. Ah, sorry. Wouldn't it be quite proper of me to show up at a girl's house now, would it? Hell yeah. <laughs> you seem awfully happy about that. Well, you just call Goro the exterminator Majima if you see one, okay? Hell yeah, perfect lesson for the first time around. Alrighty, what say we call it a day? Thank you, Majima san. Yeah, good job. So, let's see. Perfect lesson. We were having so much fun talking, I practically forgot I was training ya. <laughs> I'm glad you had fun. Thanks to you, I really feel confident now. That's great. Keep it up. Of course. I'll kick it up a notch. Hell yeah, level three already. All right. Now we are prepared to open the club. But first, club status. All right, we're going for Club Mercury、uh, now more than ever. We have 3,885 fans in that area. For Club Jupiter. It had 3,000 fans. Okay, I see. So I get the same amount of fans that the club has to challenge them, basically. So I just need 200 more to battle with Mizumura. I need, it looks like, 4,000 more to battle Kanehara. And I need 10,000 to battle Sukiyama himself. Okay, this is gonna be a long, windy road, guys. I think this is gonna have to be a two parter. I'll try to get as much done because I still got about one hour and 20 minutes left because I want to make this video three hours. But yeah, I'll, I'll make this a two parter. I might have to because it's gonna take a while to get a lot of customers in the moon area, anyways. All right, let's get into the Club Mercury area then. Let's、uh, open up there, open up shop and steal their customers. All right,、uh, open for business in the Club Mercury area. Yep, let's do this. All right, skippity skip skip. All right, looks like we finally got 4,000 fans in the Club Mercury area. That's good. All right, here we go. Congratulations, Majima san. We topped 4,000 fans from the Club Mercury area. Right on, Yoda chan. Looks like the Club Mercury area will soon be ours. And that showdown with the old man Mizumuru is coming up even sooner. Oh, he is Colonel Sanders. Yes, we have to stop Mizumuru san. He is going down the wrong path. Majima kun, it's been a while.、Oh. Well, if it ain't Hibiki chan from Club Mercury, what's up? I don't stock vinegar here. <laughs> I'm okay on vinegar. I found a shop the other day that sells a lot of it. Anyways, will you accept this? It's a challenge. We're finally gonna have a cabaret club with the old man, huh? <laughs> no hard feelings either way, okay? Alright,、uh. uh, no hard feelings. I have to be going. Bye, Majima kun. Oh. But wait. Hey, Biggie John, hey! Can you tell me even more about the store with the vinegar? Damn it. She's gone already.、Uh... That girl Hibiki had you eating out of her hand. 
He's gonna be one tough enemy. We can't lose. Uh. Yeah, not sure why you're getting so worked up, though. Like yuki -chan says, Club Mercury is a powerful enemy. Before we take him on, we should make sure to sort out our staff lineup and get ready. Alright. Ooh, boy. It's gonna... It's gonna... It's gonna be a... It's gonna be a work in progress. Let's give it a Savisu. Perfection. All right, now let's get out of here. And... I hope you're not tired, Saki-chan. I hope you can be with us for this Cabaret Club battle. All right, let's see. Prepare to open. Good, Saki-chan is still all good. This is amazing. All right, cast on duty. Let's get our three-star athletes here. And let's get all our... Actually... Psycho... You know what? You're okay. Everybody loves a Rhonda. Akemi... Actually, no. She's tired. Junko and Harumi. All right, decent lineup, and we got special training too. Yep, customer customer service too. All right, you ready for round two, Saki-chan? Of course, I'll give it my all. Okay, remember, I'm just a regular old customer. Okay. Okay, got it. Oh, it's good to see you again, Majima-san. I hope you'll have some fun tonight. <laughs> Lively as ever, Saki-chan. I love that about you. Alright, here we go. Let me think. Can I ask what you think about relationships, Saki-chan? I see. <laughs> we'll see about that. First off. What kind of fellow is your type, Saki-chan? I see. Huh? Masculine. What? You like guys to be ripped? Hell yeah! That's totally me! That's, okay, someone like you would be a dick thing to say, because she's been made fun of for that. Am I manly? That's so, that's totally me. Huh? Hey, that's me. I'm built well enough, and I'm pretty dependable sort of guy. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, so don't be so direct. Oh man, you don't mince words, Saki-chan. <laughs> oh hell yeah! They 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 done bamboozled me. Thanks for thanks for the save there. Damn. Okay, what about the reverse? Any type of guy you can't stand? Damn. I okay, narcissist I expect weaklings though. Shit. Lucky John, you from Kyushu? I'm figuring that might be playing a part here. I see. Well, yeah, they have to, if they're in a relationship, kind of. I mean, I guess. Yeah. What do you mean? I think that's just how it goes. Um, give him a chance. Mm. Now, now, you gotta give him a chance. 
Guys act tough to get a lady to know some, but deep down they just want a girl they can let their guard down around. Maybe? Me? Oh hell no. I'm tough as nails. All the time, but uh, what's wrong with a guy wanting to get a little attention from his lady? I see. <laughs> Jeez. Oh, damn. <laughs> this girl is not playing around. Whoa. Go to your happy place, Saki chan. Jeez. So, how many guys uh, have you given a chance, Saki chan? What about back in your student days? I see. Sounds like you made it through your teenage years pretty unscathed. You didn't have a crush on anyone? I see. <laughs> There's the drama I was looking for. How come you never said anything? Ooh. Huh? Hey, you did all that without saying a word to him? I see. Hmm. You should have signed it. I don't know if she likes more direct or not. Maybe you made his day. I'm sure you made that guy feel like a million bucks. Always nice to know someone cares enough to give you some chocolate. Probably. Uh. No doubt in my mind. And if he found out they were from you, he would have been over the moon. <laughs> Hell yeah. Over the moon, baby. <laughs> of course. Now you got me looking forward to it. Mm. You know, you come off pretty straightforward girl. But I think uh, you got a wide-eyed, innocent side to you. Nah. Okay, let's say you've got a date with a guy you fell head over heels for. How's it gonna play out? I see. See, boom. Innocent and a little scared, right? He's probably nervous too. I doubt he'd mind. I doubt he'd mind. The guy's gotta understand that you're nervous and his job is to make you feel more comfortable. Oh, you're going over the moon for me, baby? Yeah. You think? Now, I'm the one who's been normal. Now, I'm the one who's being normal, goddammit. A guy who can't handle a quiet date is garbage anyway. Damn. This girl is serious. <laughs> well, that wasn't a bad lesson, but it was not perfect. Alright, I've grilled you enough for today, haven't I? That second one was a bit wow. But, you know, never mind. I don't mind it. Alright, thank you, Majima-san. Yeah, good job. So, let's see. Normal lesson. That was pretty decent. Your customers are in good hands if you keep this kind of talk up. Understood. I'll keep working on it. Yeah, keep working at it. I will. Nice. Alright, level 5. That is mighty good. It's time to take on that rival battle with uh, Mizumura. Let's go, baby. 
All right, what voice did I give this guy? Colonel Sanders over here. Majima and Yoda, it's been a while. Hi. Mizumura, son, I'm gonna stop you. Yoda, just like how I used to be a long time ago. Hope your youthful enthusiasm won't be your undoing. <laughs> Yoda-chan is really fired up, for, fired up for a change. There's no way we can lose with him flipping out like that. Yes. Well, I can't lose either. I have a promise to keep. Huh? A promise, eh? Nothing you should concern yourself with. Either way, it's the end of the road for you. <laughs> <laughs> now we get to see Mizumura when he really means business. They used to call him the Lion of the Cabaret, you know? I'm looking forward to this. Sorry, old man. There ain't no way we're stopping here. Let's, let's start this up. Club Sunshine's open for business. Hi. Yes! Everybody. Oh, hell yeah. You know, I'm kind of a little jealous of your dapper suit and fedora, my dude. You may be old Colonel Sanders, but you still got the big-ass, good-ass swagger. I may say so myself. Damn, he's... Whoa! Shh. Shit, buddy. You're doing pretty good already. Slow down. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fuck. What's up? Uh, refill ice. Okay, we need a lot of enthusiasm here. This Mizamura is not joking around. He's he's going over the goddamn moon. He is focusing so hard right now. It's not even. He is going the speed of universe. <laughs> All right, swap ashtray. He's almost filling up his bar already. Like what? Like what is even going on? Shit! Well, we got a mega rich asshole here, which I um. It's not even worth it. Uh, refill ice. All right, another, another tumzup, tumzup of encouragement. Get the tumzup, girl. All right, get out of here, rich dude. I would have liked you in my club, but uh, you're too picky, apparently. Everybody's fearing tonight. Everybody's fearing. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, guest glass. All right, check. Gracious send off, uh, senor. He's gonna counter attack us so hard right now. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> Gracious send off, uh, my friend. Uh, my friend, -o. my best of friend. -o. Oh, we got a dick. We got a dick. We got a dick hole. Okay, all right. Okay, sir. Okay. 
バイボボボボンボンボボボボンボンありがとうございましたあのうん、it's cutting it pretty close. I don't think we, I think we might lose actually. Might be a humbling experience, I guess. But yeah, this dude's fever bar is filling up like no tomorrow. Uh, ladies glass. Nope. Figured that wasn't gonna happen. What's up? Stand session? Yeah! Fever time, baby! Okay, we got one mega rich guy in fever time right now. That's good. We got two mega rich guys. Uh, ladies' glass. Come on, get to rank three, baby. I want a fever time so hard right now. Average. Okay. Come on. Come on. Extend session? Thank you. Fever time, baby. Come on. Come on. Mm. Oh, finally. Okay, we might survive. Alright, gracious send off. Thank you, sir. Um, gracious send off. Thank you, sir. I wonder if Miyamura is giving expensive gifts left and right. Let's prevent them from doing any fevering. Alright, we're so okay. Alright, let's see the results. I'm kind of anxious. Oh. Oh. I just barely won that. Well, not barely, but 8 million yen above this guy. I mean, I... Ooh. Ooh. That was... Ooh, that was close. That was very close, and I'm kind of uncomfortable, I'm not gonna lie. If I decided to give a couple of gifts, then that distance would have been closed. Okay. I've taken over the Club Mercury area. Hell yeah. We are rank A right now, baby. We rule! Disappointed General Noises. Disappointed Colonel Sander Noises. We won! <laughs> yeah, we did it, Yoda-chan. Yeah. Yes. I lost. You've done well, Yoda. Splendid. After all, none of my apprentices ever surpassed you. Mizumura-san... I'm glad it was you I lost to. Now I can shut down my club with no regrets. You don't have to do that, Mizumura-san. You can still start over. We can do this the right way together. <sighs> Yoda, that's not possible. I've gone too far down a different path. <sighs> but, after all, after I lost my wife, I used every dirty trick in the book to protect the club. <sighs> as long as I was alive, I would keep the club going. That was the promise I made to her before she died promise. I'd heard about your wife's passing, but I had no idea you made a promise like that. Was it difficult for an old man like me to run a cabaret club without any help? <sighs> Went downhill quickly, and pretty soon, I was in danger of going out of business. That's when Tsukiyama appeared on the scene. Business was good, as long as I did what that man said. Whether it was converting the club from a cabaret to a cabaret club, or ripping off customers, 
I did everything he told me to. I looked past all of it because I knew that's how the club was staying open. It was basically sold my soul to my to the devil. But this is the end of the rope, Club Mercury. It's time. It was quite a while ago, in fact. I don't know when it'll be, but when I get to heaven, I'll tell my wife, tell her I'm sorry. <sighs> Mr. Murasan, I had no idea. I, I didn't know. And I said all those things to you. <laughs> Yoda, don't ever lose your, don't don't ever lose your honesty. You really remind me of myself back in the day. With you around, I'm confident the future of Soden Bori's entertainment district is in good hands. Mr. Murasan, Majima, I've seen what you're capable of doing too, and I have a favor to ask. What is it? After Club Mercury's gone, would you let Hibuka work at your club? Huh? I know she's a little weaker than some of the girls and that she can't come into work every day. Most clubs wouldn't put up with it for very long. But your club seems like the type that would actually welcome her for the talent she does have. Would you? <laughs> of course. Any girl you trained would be welcome addition to the team. That's great. Thank you. Miss Amura-san. Ibiki, thank you for everything you've done for me. Take care of your younger brother and mother. Take your family is everything. Capish? Mm. Don't ever betray the family. Yes, thank you, Mr. Murasan. <laughs> well then, time for this old soldier to turn his combat boots. We may not see each other again. Mr. Murasan. Thank you very much. Do your best, Yoda. Hi. I will. I guess Gramps was pretty cool and pretty dapper in that suit and fedora. Hey. Yes, I really looked up to him. Hello. Majima kun, thank you for everything. I'm looking forward to working with you. Ah. Yeah, I am too. I'm counting on you, Hibiki chan. <laughs> you can count on me. Love, heart. Alright, you recruited Hibiki. Uh. Right. Yeah, sure. Why are you ogling her? I ain't. R2, shut up, Yuki. You're such a fucking buzzkill. Yeah, I'm not. Oi. That's enough flirting, you two. Get a grip, and let's get serious here. Five stars are still out there. Uh. Wait, did I just get scolded from Yoda-chan? Well, that was humiliating. You watch, Mizumura-san. I'll be the one to carry your legacy forward. <sighs> I wish he'd always worked this hard. Don't worry, he'll be back to his old self tomorrow. Hi. Manjima san, everyone else, let's get ready for the next shift. Let's go! <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Are you in the club right now? What? So, even Mizamura has fallen. He was the old man who was behind the times, and all they did was kick out his crutches. So tell me, I assume there are already plans in uh, in place to deal with him? Of course. What kind of assistance would I be if I waited until you asked to take care of these matters? Remarkable as always. Go to Majima of Club Sunshine. I'm looking forward to seeing how you handle challenges that await you. Alright. Blocks have been unlocked for Breaker Style. One billion yen bonus, baby! Whoa! Well, I guess that was something. That was certainly something. All right, uh, save. Bam. Bam. All right, since we need to do that uh, whole radio show thingy anyways, let's go out and buy some drinks and then come back. I need some healing stuff. I'm lucky Mizamura didn't fight me or some shit. Not that he'd win, because he's Colonel Sanders, but you know what I mean. Hmm. Where are... Ibisu Pawn Shop, La Marche, Don Quixote. It's probably the nearest thing, the most convenient thing. M Store, Shofukucho. That's a convenient store. I don't think they'd have Toughness Emperors. All right, let's go to Don Quixote then. And since we're here, let's stop by the temple as well. 
How many CP do I have? I have 11. Golden shotgun. You know what? Casting call, baby. Hi there. Yeah? You're with Club Sunshine, right? My name is Koizumi. Can I work at your club? Koizumi-chan, huh? You seem really perky. I think you'll be really popular at our club. We'd love to have you. Yeah, Golden Coastus, baby. Looks like we got a real winner. We gotta step my game up. Alright. That's that's enough for now. Don't want to waste all my points. Don Quixote. Give me some healing stuffs. Alright. So, what's the best crap you have here? Toughness double Z. Alright. Buy as many of those as I can. I should also go to Mr. Moneybags and send money back to cure you, but... We can save that for later, I guess. For now, let's try opening for the first time in, uh, in, uh, what's that club called? The Mizumuro's Club? We're gonna try opening in his area first to see if a cutscene is triggered. And then we'll just continue. Anyways, what you got for me? Dulce. No! Cure you! Screw you! Screw you, cure you! Alright, one more postcard. Alright, uh... Aaron's on the run. No. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. You're an angel, but you're not. Alright. Save. And now let's try doing like I said and open in the boss's area. But now I've got two people to train, right? So hold on. Just a bleeding second. All right, prepare to open. Uh, cast on duty. Everybody's doing good except for Psycho, so I'll switch her out with Hibiki. And special training. All right, we have two sessions to do now. Oh, day at the disco? Hell yeah, let's go. I'm ready. All right, let's go out for dating practice. Dating practice? Yeah. Sometimes you go on dates with customers, then come into the club together. You gotta be able to have a good time. So today we're gonna practice at the disco. Oh, that sounds like fun. Can't wait. Yeah, normal. I'm not going for any special back-breaking moves or anything. Come at me. I'm the disco master. Boom, boom, boom.
Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Well, I am the boss, but I, the boss has missed a couple of notes today. The boss isn't feeling so hot today, but we did good still. You're a dancing diva, I see. <laughs> Today's practice was perfect. You got the hang of things? Yeah, dancing is fun. I learned a lot. Okay, level eight, baby. All right. Oh, I, oh, I can't do more than one special training at a time. Well, that sucks. I guess they do have to limit it some. All right, let's open for business then in... Oh, I can't do it in the boss's area yet. I see. So I have to do it a couple of times in the Club Venus area? Okay. Let's see if anything happens if we do this once. All right, skippity skip. All right, so 600 more customers in the Venus area. <laughs> Congratulations, Majima-san. We now have more than 1,500 fans from Club Meda Venus's area. Ah, I see. Uh, which one was Club Venus? It's the club owned, owned by Kanehara, the pretty boy who used to be a host. I hear he uses his looks to make the girls do whatever he wants them to. Ah, the girls actually fall for that old crap? Who knows? Girls love a good-looking guy. Also, Kanehara is apparently in, in a relationship with Chika-chan. 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 God damn it. Club Venus is number one girl. I remember that guy being pretty douchey. But uh, was he that good-looking? can't remember his damn face. Maybe we should go to Club Venus and take a look. Girl, who is this? Yoda-san, where do you keep the club's customer data and financial information? It's on a shelf in the back office. What are you doing? Hi. Okay, the next time, the, the next on my list to organize. Um, who is that? Who's she? When did we hire a hostess like that? Hey. Oh, that's Oishi-san. I hired her to do administrative work. She came in with a resume the other day. She really, that's fucking suspicious as hell. <laughs> We're adding people to, to our back office too, huh? Looks like we're, that is some okay. Watch, that's she's gonna be a spy under that is like so suspicious. Days after we start going into this guy's territory, a girl shows up that wants to do back office work and look at our financial papers. That's so sketchy, bro. <laughs> Absolutely, let's keep working towards defeating Club Venus. When you're ready to check him out, just say the word. Watch her be a spy. Majima-san, do you want to run? No, let's check out Club Venus. All right, let's go sneak a peek at Kanahara's Club Venus. Good idea. Then let's... <laughs> Where's that laugh coming from? What the crap? <laughs> it's me. Oh, you look douchey as fuck, bro. You look like a greaser, except the douchier version. And you are... Huh? What? Me? It's me! I have no idea who me is. Who are you? Eh? Wait! You don't remember me? You don't remember this beautiful face? Seriously, who are you? Huh? Seriously, who are you? Eh? Hang on a sec! You really forgot? Eh? My name is Kanehara. Kanehara. Owner of Club Venus, one of the five stars. Is that clear? Anahara. Well, now that you mention it, you do look a little familiar. I knew who you who he was as soon as he walked in. Now you tell. Now you tell me. <laughs> so you really did manage to forget my face, huh? Huh. That makes me sad. Your poor primitive brain. Really? Insults now? Whatever. What's your business here at Club Sunshine today, Kanehara of the Five Stars? <laughs> <laughs> a little birdie told me you guys were going to be scoping on the club. Figured I'd be proactive and check you guys out first. Uh -huh. And what little birdie was that? You want to cut to the chase or keep bullshitting me? 
<laughs> You're such an amateur, Manji Makun. It's the very definition of amateur hour in here. A lady, your performance is at an end. Come back home to me. Yes, yeah, kind of kind of Harasama. See, I knew it. It's way too sketch. How do you guys not see this bullshit from a mile away? Majima, don't you dare act surprised. A job well done, my little spy. I've already reserved a room at our nice hotel with a beautiful night view. Oh, I can't wait. Did you just steal the things I asked for? Yes. Club Sunshine's customer data, details on girls, financial data, I got it all. Good. Wait a minute, Yoda-chan. That can't be. Oh, she saw was a spy, but I thought... He handed me all the confidential information without a second thought. It's like taking candy from a baby. You fool! <laughs> we got played like a damn shaman... Sh shamisen? <laughs> <laughs> You should have known I'd do anything to pry the upper hand from my opponent. That's the only way to keep winning in this life or death game, Goro Majima. <laughs> Appreciate the lesson, Kanehara. <laughs> ah, such humility is rare in fools. You truly know your place. No, I just know I'm gonna kick your ass eventually, so it's all cool. Oishikun, can you take care of all the data analysis after you get back? What all the you juicy de- Oh, that's Kanehara, goddammit. Oishikun, can you take care of all the data analysis after you get back? I want the juicy details on every weakness. You got it. Anything else in it for me? Mm. Well, that depends on what you find in that data, but... How about I make a few calls and extend the little Hotei Stel? It's Stel. Hotei Stay. It'll be just the two of us, of course. With pleasure. Okay. Don't care. <laughs> No, was is simple enough. Women are so amazingly foolish. You're a special kind of scumbag, ain't ya? Mm. I'll take that as a compliment. Speaking of scum, though, I must say the seedy little club is quite fitting for you. A seedy exterior, a seedy owner. Everything here is so seedy, you can smell it in the air. Yeah, and everything there is so scummy, I can smell it on your breath, you fucker. Really, you should be honored that someone of my stature would design... Will deign to even set foot in this club. When I give it a rest with the lame insults. Yeah, I can't believe you're so rude. I don't know about Majima-san and the rest of the team, but I am not seedy. How come you got to be the only one who ain't seedy? You're as seedy as they come. Because... Amazing. A jewel among the refuse. What? What a beautiful woman. Yes, yes, you're talking about Ai-chan, right? I know how this goes, I'm not gonna fall for it this time. No, it's you, my dear. What is your name? What? You really mean me? Um, my name is Yuki. Huh? Yuki, say, do you wanna be my lady? What? I can pay you three times the peanuts you're earning here and grant you the priceless pleasure of sleeping with me. You fucking scumbag. Think about it. Instead of wasting time in a dump like this, you could be leaving a life of luxury at my side. Um, no way. Huh? huh? What'd you just say? <sighs> um, I said no way. You're not my type. Furthest thing from it, actually. So, absolutely not. Absolutely not! <laughs> <laughs> what a tease. I like you. Now I really need to make you mine. Huh? Mystery woman, you found a new girl to toy with? Ah, Chica. <sighs> and only moments after you man manipulated another girl into doing your dirty work for you. <sighs> oh, you mean Oishi spying for me? Well, she might not be the sharpest tool in the shed, but she was the right tool for the job this time. Huh? Who's that? That's Chika-chan. She's the number one hostess at Club Venus. <sighs> Is she? She's a beautiful... She's, be she's a beauty, no doubt she's got what it takes to earn that spot. Yeah, she has this mysterious air about her that just turns men into jelly. They say she's one of the top girls in Sodenbori. The rumors... The rumor that she's going out with Kanehara seems to be true as well. <sighs> You're really up on stuff like this, Ai-chan. Women are like pawns, Chika. What's more important is to move them into the right positions to make sure they fulfill their potential. 
And where and when a girl has no more value to you, you just throw her away without a second thought. But of course, and one day I'll surpass Sukiyama kun with that strategy, just you watch. Can't let something as silly as sentiment get in the way of my ambition, now can I? I know. Just need to make sure I don't get thrown away too. <laughs> I don't understand what this girl sees in this scumbag, honestly. Like, she knows all the crap that he does. Maybe she just likes bad, scummy boys. <laughs> you worry about things like that, Chica? I would never throw you away. Yeah, that's probably what you tell every single girl. As long as you're my number one girl at the club. Okay, so you would throw her away if she wasn't the number one girl at the club. Mm. I see. Well, I'll have to work harder then. Let's get out of here. You will be mine, Yuki. I promise. <laughs> I always get what I want. By any means necessary. Well then, ta-ta. Guy's a fucking creepy scumbag. Ugh. I think I just threw up a little in my mouth. Yuki-chan, you were such a big hit with him. You did it. <sighs> Not exactly happy about being, being hit on by that creep. That guy's more twisted than a pretzel. So, Kanehara and Chika from Club Venus. Well, at least things are staying interesting. Okay, let me check something. Uh, I want to check my club status. Let's see. Prepare to open club status. Wait, so Venus area. Oh, I don't got any. Oh, shit. I should probably go buy some potential partners. Oh, so he has 5,000 fans. Right now I've got 1,700. I need to get some more fans. You know what? It's been two hours, 43 minutes for me. It's probably going to be like two hours and a half for you guys. And since this is going to be a two-parter anyways, I'm going to leave it off. So what I'm thinking first off is I already bought all the crap in Jupiter area i need to i'm gonna work on getting grand hera off screen i'm gonna work on getting comey in as well i'm going to start buying out a lot of the potential partners in the club venus area and in the club moon area hopefully no i won't i actually won't start buying stuff in club moon area because that might trigger a cutscene off screen and i don't want that to happen so I'll just try to purchase a lot of areas in the Venus area. Not to the point where I surpass 5,000 fans, though. I don't want that to happen either because that will trigger the cutscene. Okay. So, yeah, I'll do I'll do what I just told you guys. I'll also... Because I know I got a couple of girls that I need to level up. Uh, level up their skills. So, I'm also just going to run a couple of cabaret club sessions... In the older areas that I've already taken over. Might as well, since those won't really affect these areas. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do off screen, guys. Anyways, I'm, I'm going to leave it off here. Thank you all for watching this episode of Yakuza 0. And I will see you all in the next one. Keep disco my disco cronies.